In this video, I'm going to show you how to create email templates in Gmail. These are great if you send the same email format frequently, for example, if you are answering clients or doing outreach for an organization or a business. So first, you're going to open up Gmail and go to your settings. From here, you're going to click See All Settings. And then on this page, near the top right, you're going to click on Advanced. Here, you should see a section called Templates. And if this is disabled, you want to go ahead and enable this. And then we're going to click Save Changes. Great, so now we're going to compose our first email template to use. Let's create one for contacting or introducing ourselves to a client. So for this, you're going to enter a subject line and then you can enter the body of the email. This is going to appear exactly how you type it in when you use these templates. So I'm going to go ahead and paste in this one that I had prepared and show you what information would be helpful to keep or to go ahead and fill out before you save this template. So in this example, since our clients' names are going to change every time, I'm just going to leave this in here in brackets so that I know that this needs to be changed out whenever I use this template. My name is not going to change from time to time that I'm sending this email, so I can go ahead and enter that. I can go ahead and enter my position because that is not going to change. Now, depending on the type of client that I'm talking to, I might want to briefly mention different expertise or services that are more specific to them. So I'm going to go ahead and leave that in those brackets so that I know that I need to go back and customize that for each client. The client's needs and goals are also going to change, so I'll leave that too. Again, my name is not going to change, so I will go ahead and put in my signature and you could put in a number or however you want them to contact you. Now that this template is done, what I'm going to do is click on these three dots where it says more options, and then I'm going to hover over templates, save draft as template, then save as new template. It will use the subject line that you entered, but you can change this to something else if you wanted. In this case, this works perfectly, so I'm going to go ahead and click Save. So we can close out of this email, and whenever you want to use this email template now, when you start creating a new email and you go back to those three dots at the bottom, now under Templates, you'll see that template that we just created. When I click on this, it will auto fill out our email. And from here, I can go ahead and fill out that information that I needed to change out depending on the client. And that's it, your email is ready to send. So setting up templates like this is a great way to streamline your email process or get your email inbox set up for an assistant to handle emails the way that you like to handle them. If this was helpful, be sure to subscribe.